We're joined once again by Victoria. Yay! It's been a couple of weeks since you went directly to the finals yeah. at Melody Festival. Yeah. February 13th. Yeah. A day that changed your life. It definitely changed my life. <laughs> yeah. Well, the next day was Valentine's Day, February yeah. 14th. Mm -hmm. How did you spend Valentine's Day? Uh, I spent Valentine's Day on a train yeah. uh, on my way home to Stockholm. And when I got home, I just like I turned the TV on and just watched a movie. <laughs> so you didn't myself. have anyone special, no special Valentine's? <laughs> no, I didn't. Well, I was in a similar situation. I too was on a train <laughs> back home. So I think to make things fair, I have this. Would you like to be my Valentine? I would love to. Awesome. Aww. This was on sale too. It's 50% off right now. <laughs> Speaking of Valentine's, your song is about being so much in love. You need saving, you're telling your mama mm -hmm. how much in love you are. Mm -hmm. Have you ever been that much in love before? No, I haven't. Actually, I've never been in love. Mm -hmm. And I'm 19. We're <laughs> um, still quite young, so... Yeah, but I don't know, like, I never had a boyfriend. I've never been in a relationship. Mm. I think it's because I've always been focusing on music and my friends and my family. Right. So, it just hasn't been in my life. When I sing this... I feel like not that I can relate on the I can't relate to the oh I've been so madly in love that I don't know what to do right but I definitely can relate to loving people so much that it hurts like I've been loving friends and family mm. and you can be so scared and afraid that something will ever happen to them right. like you love them so much right not many people know much things about you yeah what's your past been like how long have you been doing music for I've been doing music for like Professionally, uh, for a few years now, mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure I've been, I was in a girl group before mm -hmm. and now here I am, mm -hmm. um, solo career and, but it's it's fun, but music's been my life since I was a little kid. My right. daddy, he plays the piano and my si big sister, she sings as well, yeah. so music's always been in my life. And how did the whole contest come about? Did you approach someone or did someone approach you to be in Melody Festival? And no, we just, we found this song and we felt like it was amazing. We really loved it and we felt like it was different. Mm. And we was like, okay, but okay, Melody Festival, it's a great like window just to show who I am as a mm. debutante and it can be a great first step in my career. So what's happened since you went direct to the finals? Are people recognizing you on the streets now? Um, what have you been up to? Um, I don't know, like people are, are definitely recognizing me. And I can see that, but it's different. It's it's weird, and it's just fun. Now this year we've seen a lot of young singers. Yeah. We've seen Lisa, Isa. Yeah. Um, how do you feel about having so much young people in the competition? Do you think it's better for you, or do you think it's nice that more young people are getting the opportunity to show themselves, or do you think it's more competition now that? I don't know. I, I'm just happy to be in the competition, so I don't see it that much of a cup like a competition. Mm -hmm. I'm just here to do my thing and to just like mm -hmm. show people who I am. But I, I think it's fun that young people get the opportunity to be in the competition and to see that the competition ch is changing and that mm -hmm. new kind of songs, not the typical charter. Like mm -hmm. it's it's different. Now. Compared to I guess some of the other artists in the contest, yeah. like maybe Molly or David, you don't have that much of an established fan base like they do. No. Do you think that's gonna, like, how does that affect your performing? Do you feel like you have to give it extra, or is it something you just don't think about? You just do your thing? I don't think about it. I just do my thing. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I know the song, I know what I'm supposed to do, so I'm just gonna go in there and do my thing and show right. people who I am and not think of it as a competition and to think of all the other fan bases and all the other great artists. Because, like, everyone's great and everyone's doing their thing, so I'm here to do my thing. And you mentioned before you're working on some EPs in the studio or some more songs. Yeah. When, I know you have a lot to think about, but when do you think we could expect to hear some more things from you? Uh, we, we'll definitely release something for the summer mm. uh, so that I have more songs if I will be on tour. Um, speaking of music, you have a brilliant voice. Thank you. And uh, I, unfortunately, don't have a brilliant voice, <laughs> but I love to do karaoke. And like you would totally be my BFF at karaoke because you have an amazing voice that you would drown out how average I am. <laughs> <laughs> so would you be up for trying out some karaoke to see how we would do as a team? Okay. Yeah? Okay. Let's do it.